Hello everybody, welcome back. Another Photoshop 2023 tutorial. On this one, I want to show you how to do fine selections or pixel perfect down to the individual pixel. And I'm not kidding, the individual pixel perfect selections. Now in this case here, I've got a rough selection here. And all you got to do to get a rough selection is I'm just going to go to select, deselect. So we're starting at the beginning. And then for me, I just went to grab the quick selection tool. And then I just grab the select subject, but I just select subject cloud, which gives me a detailed results. Then I'm going to click on select subject and bang, we've got a rough selection. There are multiple ways to make a rough selection, including the quick selection tool, the object selection tool, etc. That's not the point of this tutorial. The point is, is that after we've got our rough selection, when I zoom in here to the tip of the needle, which is where I wanted to show you, you'll notice that this is not a good selection for the needle. It's not a fine selection. It's not going to look right. So how do we do that? That's what I'm going to show you. Okay, so we've got our selection. Now we're gonna go ahead and zoom in to the tip of the needle so I can show you how this is done. Again, now I'm zoomed in at 600% and I'll probably zoom in a little further. Anyways, the next step, and this is the critical one, is you can press Q on your keyboard and that enters what's called quick mask mode. Alternatively, you can click on this button here on the left side that says edit in standard mode and then edit in quick mask mode. It looks like a sort of a camera-ish lens. So there you go. Press Q. Now we're in quick mask mode. Now, the next step is not to grab this quick selection tool, which is what I want to do, but it's actually not correct. You actually want to go over to the left side here and grab your brush tool. And when you do that, you want to now set your foreground color to white and your background color to black. And if you just click on them and select the color just like that, so you'll see white and black. Now, and this is the pixel perfect part. So what you want to do now is grab a brush. I'm going to grab a hard round brush and I'm going to set the size of the brush to exactly one pixel. And I am going to zoom way in to like 2000%. And now what you do is I've got my brush, brush selected. I'm painting with white. I'm in quick mask mode. And now look, I'm just painting in. And because it's a one pixel brush, I'm painting in the parts that I want to keep. And in order to toggle to see how well you're doing, all you got to do is press the Q button. So I'll press Q and I'll be like, okay, I'm at the tip of the needle. This part here needs to be brushed in. So I'm going to go back into quick mask mode by clicking Q. And then I'm going to just sort of color that in and something like that. And then I'm going to be like, okay, this needs to be now brushed in and etc. But again, one pixel at a time if needed. Now, when I press Q again, you're going to notice here that this part underneath the needle tip should not be brushed in. It should be taken out. So this should not be selected. So I'm going to press Q and now I'm going to press X or I'm going to click this button here, which reverses or switches the foreground and background color. So I'm just going to press X or switch those colors. And now I'm just going to paint over the part with black that I don't want. And again, I am painting in my selection. This is pretty tight, I know. And now I'm going to hit Q and check it. Okay, looking good. And literally, you can do this all the way till the end. So I'm just going to keep painting in and then checking it. That's how you make pixel perfect selections in Photoshop. Thanks for watching.